What is up everybody, it's me, Jack C, and welcome back to another machine learning paper review. Today's topic is all about semantic segmentation using vision transformers. Note that I'm only covering this section right here, so take a look at the original paper, okay? Wait a minute, but what is semantic segmentation? Well, you see, let's say you have a picture, and then you assign a class to each pixel, and this is what you get, and this is essentially semantic segmentation. Easy, right? Nowadays, we use vision transformers to perform semantic segmentation. But wait, there's more to it than just that, you know? Number one, Stream Transformer takes the stage, offering a general purpose backbone for semantic segmentation by using hierarchical feature maps and a shifted window approach that managed to achieve impressive accuracy. Number two. Now let's talk about Segmenter, a pure transformer-based approach uh, with no more convolution. It takes a vision transformer backbone and uses a mass transformer as the decoder. And it's all about capturing that global context. And hey, it, it reflexes its muscle on panoptic segmentation tasks as well. Number three. Enter SecFormer with its hierarchical transformer encoder and an MLP decoder for precise segmentation. They got some cool tricks up their sleeves like positional encoding free design, making it faster and more robust than the competition. Size, accuracy, and runtime, they got the perfect blend. Number 4. Hey, who are you? Wait, are you my secret twin? Twins introduces two modern transformer designs. Twins PCPVT and Twins SVT, revisiting PVT and Stream Transformer. Twins SVT even uses spatially separable self attention mechanism for higher efficiency. And these twins are not just keeping up, they are giving the competition a run for its money. Number 5. Last but not least, Mass Transformer comes in with a universal architecture. Uh, with mass attention and a transformer decoder. It's like the Swiss Army knife of segmentation, outshining specialized architectures for panoptic instance and semantic segmentation. All of it. Woo! That was a lot of them. If you are as intrigued as I am, let me know down in the comments below. And as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more exciting machine learning content. Until next time, stay curious and stay funky.